everyone to another episode of the one minute quarters fantasy draft today's episode is against the la chargers and we simply just have to win this game to secure the two seed in the playoffs we have clinched a spot in the playoffs we've also actually clinched our division it's just if we win this game we can clinch the two seed and if we do lose this game depending on results elsewhere we could still clinch the two seed just might have to be a three or a four seed so, like, there's not a huge need to win this game, but we've had a lot of momentum. We'd like to keep that going heading forward. But for some reason, I have a feeling we're just going to completely blow it in this game. Like, I think Geno Smith is going to get hurt. Like, for whatever reason, I just feel so negative about everything that's about to happen. And I can't explain why. And Jared Goff is their QB. Justin Jefferson, their best receiver. So, they also have Alvin Kamara. So, they have a very good, good team. Good tackle there by Isaiah Rogers. Alright. Trying to this little 4 3 defense now since they are going with a fullback on the field. Good job, Javon Hargrave. And Drake London just got injured. So that significantly helps our chances. And let's call a third down blitz. Don't always like to blitz on third down. But I think it's just, we just should. Good tackle there. Phillips will take a timeout. We can get the ball back in the first half. Which pretty much every time we do get the ball in the first half, we go on to win the game. All right, they got Jake Kamara to punt. All right, we will take it at the 45 yard line. That's excellent field position. And Geno Smith is our QB, who would spend an up and down ride with him, as all Madden quarterbacks just seem to be. But it's been a lot more of a positive than negative as of late, so we'll look to keep that trend going. Man, I don't know if it's the route that that's being run, but that throw always looks so open, but can never just connect on it. Don't know what it is. But a big plus for this team is Cordero Patterson at a running back position, plus Chris Olave wide receiver able to do things like that out of nowhere. Shout out Chris Olave, such a good player. Hopefully he can stay healthy in real life and continue to be amazing. But that is a huge touchdown for us. We don't really get the scores in the first quarter of games, let alone first half, so we are pretty much gonna win this game. From what I, in my expert opinion, can tell. Alright, kick off deep middle. Actually, we will sky kick it because I want them to return it so it goes to the second quarter. Plus, I mean, Tucker sky kick goes to the 10 yard line. All right, there we go, 24 yard line, took some time off the clock. Pretty much the same thing as a touchback, except we burned that second. They don't get their free timeout. They are in single back, we'll go nickel. Give me on Javon Hargrave, he's playing very good today. And really the last couple of episodes. All right, only a gain of six. Let's go into dime now. Gonna stay on Javon Hargrave. All right, take some time off the clock for a very minimal gain. Guess pass. All right, Goff is just gonna check it down apparently. Would've liked for him to catch that ball just to take an extra second or two Actually, they'll probably make an extra 20 seconds off, actually. All right, let me go on... Let me stay on Al Woods. Just go one-on-one -on -one with the center. 
Good tackle there, Isaiah Rogers. Let's call another blitz. Going Robert or er, Leonard Floyd. Both, since we're blitzing from the opposite side. There we go. Fourth and 16, we'll call a timeout. Try to block this punt. If we can't block the punt, probably just run it once. Just except we're not gonna score this again this half. Oh, I was completely free. Completely free, just couldn't get the animation. That's unlucky. Just very unlucky. Alright, let's just try a bomb to Godwin. I mean, we're not going to be able to score another touchdown if, unless it's a huge coverage beater. Like this, if it's press man and Olave can get past that guy there. I mean, we can hit D-Hop over the middle. He'll get us to the 48-yard line, maybe field goal territory. 65 yards for Tucker. Can he make it? It'll just go in. Oh my, if this goes in. 65 yards from Justin Tucker. Wow. I think that is by far the longest field goal I have ever kicked on Madden. So, that's... That is a moment in history, not only for this channel, but just my entire life. Because I've never, I think I might have kicked a 64 yarder. Because I know I've tied the field goal record. Or I no, I broke it at one point back on like Madden 11. Or no, Madden 12. But that is a huge kick. Ooh, press man. Please let DeAndre Hopkins toast his man. Please be a cover one. It is. He didn't toast him, but Thielen did. Oh! Oof! That corner had some very good awareness there. This does not look like it's man, press man again. What is that throw, Gino? Like, what? Who are you throwing to? Like, that's not the route he was supposed to... Geno Smith, man. Every time he's doing good, he messes it up. Without fail. Alright, Justin Jefferson can't come up with a catch there. Marcus Peters. He doesn't get many picks, but the players he's guarding never really seem to catch the ball. So I guess he just has that aura. I mean, Justin Jefferson's gonna make that catch. Let's not be crazy. It's Justin Jefferson. He's a little good at football. Just, just, just a little. All right, inbounds will take us to the fourth quarter now. All right. I'm feeling so good right now. Yes, pass. All right, tackled. Almost really bad. Because he did kind of burn his man. Yes, Hargrave. Bro, Floyd, how do you not get to him there? Like, do I really have to switch on to you just for you to make a tackle? Like, are we that bad of players, guys? One of these guys is going to make a run. I have to cover it. Bro, how slow is Jordan Poyer on Madden? To the point that who? Robert Tunyon is outrunning Jordan Poyer. Like, 
heck? What is that? Can we block another field goal? Ooh, almost, almost. All right, they are gonna onside it. We will go onside XL. Purely because, I mean, I had no, no clue how onsides really, oh, okay, Ricard. Just, <laughs> I don't think that's what the uh, guys are supposed to do on that one, but you know what, you do you, Ricard. You do you. All right, we'll try this little PA boot, because I assume they're gonna bite on the run. Geno Smith, why are you running? I told you, I made him stop moving. All right, we'll try PA deep in. Just gotta see what decision that safety makes. Why are you taking eight years to wind up your pass? I pump fake to Waller so the safety bites and I throw a fire move. It's very, very simple. What is that warp? We're like warping onto players. Can Tucker make this field goal? I don't know. Can, he made a 65 yarder. I don't think he'll be able to kick a 57. Just something about the math doesn't sit right with me. Oh, oh, wow. That was surprising. All right, we'll try to kick off with Tucker. Pin him deep left. So 21 seconds, they have one timeout. We can't give up a touchdown. All right, defense. Time to earn your money. Show to me we can close out a game. Because offensively, we cannot. Tackled inbounds, make them waste their time out good. All right, Leonard Floyd now. I've been doing good with him against this left tackle. Ooh, good. It has to be a Hail Mary. This play has to be a Hail Mary. They cannot afford to do anything else. Guess pass, guess pass, guess pass. Go from Phillips, just watch the play. All right, they ran the save clock one, so they're not gonna get it. Let them catch it, it doesn't matter. It simply just does not matter. You, you can't call the save, the save clock one and expect to get the actual Hail Mary to, Hail Mary to work. Because you're not gonna get any sort of tips to be caught for some spam catch. And I think we just secured the two seed in the playoffs. So that means wild card round coming up next. And we will be facing off against the Indianapolis Colts. We are the two seed, they are the seven seed. It's gonna be an interesting game, have the momentum. Hopefully things can go. It's also my first playoff game of Madden 24 I have played, so try not to get the let the uh, moment get to me or choke it. But hopefully you guys enjoy the series so far, and let's see if I can make a magical run. And I'll see you all for the next episode.